My name is Bianca Ugar. I am a second year medical student at Rutgers, New Jersey Medical School. I came across Sketchy last year during my first year of medical school, and it was when I was looking at microbiology. I was going through my pages of first aid and there was so much detail to learn and I was getting really overwhelmed. Um, but a lot of students above me and more older than me suggested Sketchy and I was on Reddit and everyone said that Sketchy was like the gold standard for micro. I started watching it and I immediately fell in love. There was just so, it was so easy to get the memory hooks and to get all the little details really quickly. And it was funny, like I didn't expect to be laughing throughout the videos. Uh, and it made studying for micro actually enjoyable. And I looked forward to studying it, which I never in a million, were, like, a million years would have thought that. Um, so after micro, I figured out that they had a sketchy path. And that's when I started using it pretty much every day. Um, whichever like organ system I was learning, I would always like watch lecture and then watch sketchy or watch sketchy first and then watch lecture. So it's very much a daily occurrence for me to be like watching my cartoons as my boyfriend calls it. Like I <laughs> definitely wake up in the morning and watch my cartoons. Um, but yeah, and then I really enjoy that you guys added the anatomy. Um, I use that a lot for neurology. I thought it was really good for the cranial nerves. Um, and I started watching it for physiology now that I'm in dedicated. Uh, so I honestly use like every aspect of sketchy just because I feel like my brain is like sketchified now. That's what I call it in my head is that I can only learn using sketchy. Um, so yeah, it's pretty much one of the main resources that I use. It's like um, an animated comic book series that uses uh, really specific vignettes to create these memory hooks for both really big picture concepts and really small nitty gritty details using symbols that Sketchy kind of repeats in all of their vignettes about different um, pathophysiology or anatomy. And um, yeah, it just uses really easy symbols throughout the videos um, and it uses it through visual storytelling. Just invest into a really good resource um, when I was studying for MCAT, I just used like the free UWorld and I was struggling like every single day. It was not a good time. And uh, I really wish I had something to kind of solidify the details uh, like I had with Sketchy. Um, and if I could have just like dedicated a, like a big chunk of my study time to Sketchy with MCAT, I think I would have done really, really well.